Hello, pickle viewers. Welcome to the Who Reviews. Where today I review Gotten Season 2, Episode 16. May and uh, name episode is Prisoners. This one begins where Gotten lets off with the uh, Gordon in prison. This one through the day routine, sleeping, jail, get out, have food, exercise. Go back and go back into jail, or the cell. Where I don't want to say jail. And then the old friend of ex commissioner Talbot comes along and transforms into the F wing. I think that's what it's called. Where some of the criminals that he or uh, Gordon and Bullock have put away. Um, one of them is the brother of the this is the uh, Guy from the Red Hood gang and this out for blood for Gordon. And the other name of the place is End of the World. As the Warden said, it's because uh, there's only two ways to get out of that place they're uh, dying or bail, and they don't get bail. And I get spoilers in this. And with Harvey, he's trying to find. Does it Find a fun way to get Gordon out of there, and he tells Gordon that Leslie has left Gotham to move to somewhere in the south, and she lost their baby. And that's just a nail in the coffin for Gordon to give up hope. And when uh, the brother of the Red Hood member attacks Gordon, Another image called Puck defends him. I just call Gordon a hero since uh, he saved his sister from the Silent Snatchers from season 1. And the reason he's in there is because he sold the car to press a girl. I'm just starting to tell Gordon not to go home and stuff like that. And yet another friend in the prison, a guard, which is kind of good. And Edward is just getting a bit worried since uh, Bullock is. They're trying to yeah, figure out who's trying to get yeah, brain born, so. You know. And with also again along very well with his father, but with his kind of step siblings and mother, I don't know if their mother is married to Oswald's father or what, but they're just worried that they might, that Oswald might die. Uh, Come between them and their inheritance. His father has a heart condition. And the two together are still creepy. And there's a bit of a weird scene where his dad stepsister tries to seduce him. Only got them as water stole, eh? Ugh. I don't know what your show would be, but I think Gotham is the only program or so ever that does this sort of thing. It can't. I just don't know why. Anyway, it's movie night in uh, the prison, and the guard just warned Gordon that the uh, guy is out from storage or something and might jump him during movie night. And he does and just stabs Gordon repeatedly. And he's in a body bag, but he's alive. And Jackie Bullock has gone out. And Don Falcone is back in this. And I just well, like it. He's one of the best parts of season one, I think. I just like the character. And uh, they get the uh, puck out since they have to go to the medical wing of the hospital when the uh, the brother of Red Hood uh, guy beat the crap out of him. And the guard knocked out the warden because he just felt like it, I think. And the part they to do the gal. And then they'll call this gives uh, Gordon a choice either to leave Gotham because he has uh, some uh, contacts to get him out of there or just 
find a quiet place and got them to hide or something. And Gordon chooses to stay. And then the kid just dies. I don't know how the, the demon just didn't work him out. What he originally thought, but whatever. And he kind of, I feel kind of bad since he's turning him a bit unfair. Like they think they should stay away from him and uh, that he's not a hero or a friend, but whatever. And again, with Oswald, that uh, when his father is having him. That that his father is suffering from the same thing. That's the same thing that Penguin suffering from, which is craziness. I don't know. It's a hereditary. How could craziness be hereditary? I just don't get that. But yeah, and then he died after drinking some wine or something, or just having a heart attack, which was meant for Penguin, but whatever. And I think it's kind of good that uh, Penguin's father doesn't rematch in their care if Penguin uh, had a dark past. Sometimes the parents of villains dead or accepted or just thrown out on the street or something. So I'm glad they went, through, went for the accepted role. role. Um, just and there. This is a good episode. Just some serious, mo serious moments or a little bit of wacky ones. As a strong reason, you have Penguin's father talk to Penguin like he's a priest for some reason. It makes no sense to me. And Terry Harmon is just great in a role. I was very Paul Rooms, I'm like, his name is character, the character's name. Paul Rooms is just great in a role, no matter. I know he's not even two episodes of this, but he was just. Great. And uh oh yeah, oh well okay. Three episodes at ten on ten. Uh next week Edward is gonna do another plan and probably Gordon got have some clues of who uh brains on so that's what I see. Um till that time, I'm the two and I'll see you later.